Alright guys, thus far, I am number one. As you see up top here, leaderboard ranked first place. That's what we're going to try to keep it at. So I'm trying to attack as many monsters as I can within the last 24 minutes of the game. I started out in what ninth place, then I went to fifth, then I went to first. I guess I gotta wait till I get back to base. So I just keep refreshing till they pop up. There we go. <clears throat> so guys, I'm gonna pause here and maybe come back within the last couple minutes or so of the game just to see where I end up on the leaderboard, so stay tuned. Alright guys, so we still have 18 minutes left, but, and we're still fighting, let me show you the points. So here, as you see, I'm first place, we're at 23.5, the second person is at 18.5, so they're still playing as well. So I'm going to try to continue to play as much as I can to continue to uh, level up, hopefully we can continue and we can end our first um, our first um, I guess what is this like a quest monster slaying quest. Hopefully we can finish in first place. So we still working on it, guys. We are still working on it. And this game is very addictive. Um, I will do a video on this game um, coming here in the near future. And all this stuff I had to learn on my own. I asked folks in the, in the realm for advice. No one gave me advice. So I'm learning on my own and therefore I can pass on information. Um, let me turn this down. Therefore, I could pass on information to you guys if you uh, have any questions or whatnot and if I know the answer. So, we're going to continue to fight a good fight and hopefully end off in first place. So, we're going to keep going. Alright, folks. We are at the last stretch, the home stretch of um, the leaderboard here. And... Here, uh, this is the solo monster slaying quest. Here we have daily clan contest and the skeletons of Skelefun. Now, we don't have any points in that. We've got 213,466 points in the daily clan. And here, 40 seconds left. Here, I am the top tier. So let's see, we are going to end that way, which is freaking awesome. This is my first time actually um, ever um, winning, I guess, top tier on the leaderboards. So we got to go ahead and um, put this out there, definitely. But again, I want to show you Daily Clan. Here we can see the clan members and their points towards the daily clan quests. And here I'm number one. <clears throat> All these people are in my clan. So these are the top 11 people in the clan that have scored points. Um, and here you have different, all the different little um, activities and the points and then the what you get if you win or whatnot. And here we can collect all of this stuff since we did get number one and we got a ton of stuff here then that's gone so now we've got daily clan 
um, here where we can uh, go ahead and um, attempt to get points and this is more difficult because you know you get uh, 50 folks in your clan and um, here these are feats okay I'm gonna go here so here <clears throat> Here's my clan. It's between gamers. It is in fact public. And leaderboard rank is 104. Eh, whatever. Uh, clan chest level is at level 1. Here I have 50 of 50. So there's 50 clan members here. And this gives you the location of where they are. We have X and Y and you can go to that location by plugging it in um, and uh, go to wherever these people are located and so there's that and so yeah just wanted to showcase um a little bit and um again i will probably do more gameplay but um i don't know i don't know we'll see um we shall see i want to do more gameplay but hmm we'll see <laughs> so again i just wanted to showcase the very first time that i was first placed on the leaderboards this is freaking amazing so yeah the clan overall is not very high um so we are working on that slowly but surely and then here are more stats to those of you who are into that kind of thing there's a ton of different stats down here. Uh, every time I lose a person, I gain more people. So that's cool. Um, here, the realm rankings, we are 2,641. Our might is extremely low. So we need to actually, we need to step it up. Definitely. Here, I'm always training. Um, and I'm always researching. And right now I'm researching some things, researching the resource gatherer. And uh, they also come up with some, you have daily clan quests as well as daily solo quests. Those also help out, uh, like the clan quests help out the clan as a whole. And everybody gets a piece of the pie. Um, though, you know, for everyone who contribute, everybody gets a piece of the pie of um, items that you get. Here are the reports of... Um, your winnings or losses or whatnot and things of that nature then uh, training here I'm training militia um, and as you see it's take it's gonna take an hour to train them you can use your resources to kind of speed that up or whatnot but eh, that could be a bit you know um, difficult um, here I've made it down to resource gathering I need to research more in reference to, I guess, army strength. Because I need to get down to guard unlock. That's what I need to get down to. So what I'm going to do after is research this Dragon March Cap 2. I'm going to try to make it down to guard unlock. Because once I make it down to guard unlock, then I will be able to train guards. So that'll be cool. And I'm... Um, that would be really good because I need guards. So there's like, like I said, there's a ton. Um, and we also get clan chests based off of the work that people put in that are in the clan, of course. Um, and here is where I was saying you would go to your boards to where you have your regular, your regular um, missions and then you have your clan missions. So I try to do those every day, uh, at least once a day, to put some kind of points on the board. But yeah, uh, again, I can do a video if you guys want. Um, if you do, leave a comment below as well as, um, okay, so I need to upgrade, as well as uh, maybe a like or whatnot. And we'll see what we can do. So yeah, I'm going to... Le oh, we got a chest, guys. We've got a chest. Let's open that up and see what's in it. So this here is a clan chest. And this person that's in the clan actually did enough work to be able to um, attain a clan. 
So we're going to open that. And as you see, these are the items that we get. 17 keys, one um, grog. <laughs> well, I guess, you know, beer or whatnot. Two coins. Clear that out. And then... Um, so yeah, all of these go again towards the benefit of the clan. Oh yeah, I need to upgrade some of them. So it's 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 directing me to what it wants me to upgrade. Um here as far as fighting monsters, you fight them and then you get that space to build on. So I've I've gotten all the way out here. Then as you get here, see these guys right here on the left, they are holding a dragon so you if you win, beat them and win then you get that dragon the ones on the right have a dragon as well the ones above actually have an egg so you can actually get that egg hatch it and then you have more dragons so here i've got three so there's one here no i think i have four there's one there where's the other one okay there's two right there so two, three, and then that one that's flying around the um, the front here of the gate. So let's see, what am I going to upgrade? Uh, let's upgrade. Reading is fundamental, so we're going to go ahead and upgrade the university. And as you see here, if you want, you can speed it up. And this gives you increments in which you can use. You got eight hours speed up, five minutes speed up or either you can use um the rubies and um i normally just let it do its own thing but we've got 56 minutes on training eight minutes on research and 37 minutes on leveling up the university so that's basically the gist of how this game works and then you're trying to level up each individual um element that you have here like here is a dragon spire here are my dragons um <laughs> wrecker and bob <laughs> they're like the swamp type dragons and then here okay that one's locked so then we've got uh two we've got who is this frank <laughs> uh that's cute and then we've got um chomper and so here i can actually feed chomper so let's feed chomper there we go and then he leveled up a little bit and then we've got ruby ruby sounds so cute so then we're going to go ahead and feed ruby level ruby up a bit and um so yeah as you see that's what you do you gotta feed your uh dragons and they are assigned automatically if i'm not mistaken to different locales so like again again i'm still learning about the game in general so but yeah other than that i guess that'll be it for this video again if you would like to see more gameplay be sure to uh leave a like and be sure to leave a comment either or you know so yeah uh this is a cool game it hasn't been long come out i think it came out probably about not even a week ago and um so yeah i've been excited to play this game and there are more mobile games that i'm gonna have coming here in the near future too as well so all right guys i'm gonna leave it here until next time guys take care be safe and see you all later peace